today i am going to prepare kadamba sambar for that uh, kadamba means mixed mixed vegetables i am going to use for making sambar so for that i have got carrot radish field beans and uh, this beans no, uh, i mean uh, normal beans uh, then um, pumpkin then uh, ridge gourd pieces For this kadamba sambar, I am going to use these things for roasting. This uh, roasted masala. See, one spoon of tur dal. I mean, one and a half spoon of tur dal. Two spoons of coriander seeds. Few red chillies. a uh, very limited fenugreek and 1 cup of grated coconut yes this green chili i mean sorry red chili as required and very minimum fenugreek you fenugreek is very good for health it gives coolness to our body but we should use only minimum otherwise it will give you bitter taste if you use or add more means it will become it will give you bitter taste so give only minimum put minimum to get good aroma good smell now the roast uh, everything is roasted i'm going to add the secret ingredients which will make the sambar or kadamba sambar tasty they that they are nothing but onion and uh, tomato again fry it again fry along with the roasted things Uh, this one onion and one tomato is going to give more taste for this kadamba sambar yeah it's mm. getting cool after few minutes it will become in normal heat i'm going to grind it in a mixer as a paste i'm going to grind it in the mixer after few minutes i'll get the paste now everything is grinded i got this state the uh, vegetables are boiled in this the water i am not going to waste i will be using this to make the grinded paste in a semi liquidized form now it is in a, in this density along with this i am going to add tamarind solution don't worry how it has become very thin no nothing to worry because i am going to boil uh, tur dal and uh, moong dal within few minutes and i'll add along with this see Seventy-five percentage of kadamba sambar work is over. I'm going to boil moong dal and moong dal mixed with tur dal. After few minutes, I'll mix with this. Now itself it has got uh, better density, but more density I'll be adding dal. I'll use this spoon. In this spoon. Two spoons of moong dal and six spoons of tur dal. I'm going to wash it and boil it, and I'll add this into the kadamba sambar. I'll pour water. I've added turmeric and uh, oil, cooking oil, and castor oil also we can use for making our body cool, and this. beautiful yellowish colored uh, mixed two dolls i'm going to boil within few minutes yes the doll is boiled 
I am going to add this in the sambar. I'll mix that doll with this sambar for additional taste. I'm going to put fenugreek. I mean, sorry, I'm going to add a safutida, salt to taste for aroma and garnishing, coriander leaves and curry leaves, and uh, along with the curry leaves uh, and coriander leaves, uh, I added jaggery. The last seasoning, this is having secret ingredients of more taste, enriching more taste. That is nothing but along with the mustard and urud dal, I have added uh, uh, this, ghee, this ghee, gingerly oil and cooking oil with curry leaves. Yeah. Kadamba sambar is ready. If you want to give more and more taste for that, uh, along with the curry leaves, uriddal, you can fry cumin seeds also. That will also give you more and more and more tasty.